If you love beach towns, then you are going to love Surfside Beach. This is a small, family-friendly beach town that is in between Myrtle Beach and Myrtle's Inlet. And it has long been known throughout the Grandstand as the official family beach. Our Wander Surfside Beach location offers beach access via a personal boardwalk, has a private pool that's open year-round, and has stunning views of the Atlantic Ocean from nearly every angle. While you have everything you could possibly need on site, the home is only about a 20-minute drive from the Myrtle Beach boardwalk. Myrtle Beach sits along South Carolina's Atlantic coast and is also home to over 80 golf courses. There's also countless activities to do here at Surfside Beach, from parasailing to mini golf, to renting jet skis and banana boats. You'll have no trouble filling your schedule and making memories that will last a lifetime. Before we get into the guide, I wanted to share a little tip with you. We here at Wander believe that life has enough stress and travel should be an escape. And that is why we have our 24 seven concierge team to ensure that you have your best trip ever. Text us at 737-377-3205 at any time during your trip to help with planning from restaurant recommendations to booking an activity or even an excursion. You have 60 miles worth of beaches to choose from for fun in the sun. Surfside Beach is known as the family beach and is usually more low key and not as crowded as Myrtle Beach proper. Another bonus is that the beach is right outside of your Wander home. And while you'll want to get ample beach time in during your stay at Wander Surfside Beach, there are plenty of other sights to see here. If you love art and you love botanical gardens, then you gotta come here to Brook Green Gardens. This was recently named one of the top 10 botanical gardens in the country. And they also have incredible sculptures, a huge collection of American figurative sculptures here. So it's really like an outdoor museum, unlike anything else you're gonna see in the entire planet. And if you have kids, you're in luck because they actually have a zoo here and a butterfly garden. We're gonna check it all out. Come along with me. So you're gonna see a lot of really impressive sculptures throughout this garden, but this is actually one of the most impressive and this is Pegasus. This piece is the largest in the entire area and it took nine years to sculpt this by hand. So make sure you fully explore the area while you come here because throughout the gardens, you'll find little surprises and some big surprises like this one. I'm here at the Low County Zoo. This is a different portion of the Brook Green Gardens. And here, although it's called a zoo and they have tons of animals, it feels much more natural, much more like a nature reserve here. And that's what makes it so special. So as you explore the grounds, you'll feel very much like you're in nature. And that's what they wanted you to experience here. You get up close and personal with all types of local animals. It's a great experience for kids and families. I'm here at the Myrtle Beach Boardwalk. There's always something going on here. It's kind of like if you've ever been to Times Square or Coney Island, it's like the two met together and had a baby and that is the Myrtle Beach Boardwalk. There's always something interesting going on, as you can see, really interesting cars on the streets, great for people watching. At night, there's just lights, there's arcades, there's stores, there's restaurants, there's a Ferris wheel. And also during the day, they are right along the beach. So you have great views of the ocean. A lot going on here. Make sure you stop by. We're gonna be exploring this area and doing a little shopping, seeing what's going on, getting the little vibe of the area. One of the lovely things you can do here is a dolphin watch cruise and we are doing it here with Blue Water Adventures. We're gonna see some dolphins today. This is in Merle's Inlet. The whole experience is an hour and a half. Make sure you bring layers, sunscreen. This is gonna be cool. It's full out on the open ocean. Let's do it. This is just such a great way to see dolphins. You see dolphins, you can even see sharks sometimes, uh, turtles, tons of birds. And the captain was just so fun and informative. He shared tons of information, not just about the animals we see, but also the shoreline. And this boat is carbon neutral. So they're very conscious of the climate and the environment and are trying to do the best things to keep our planet clean and safe. Highly recommended. 
The Wander Surfside Beach has everything you need to cook a delicious meal in our modern and spacious kitchen, and we can even facilitate a grocery delivery. Sometimes you just want to eat out. And this area is known for its seafood. So if you're going out, you got to try that. But don't worry, if you're not into seafood, there are other restaurants that have non-seafood options that you can try too. In this section, I'm going to cover three places that you're going to love dining here. If you're a seafood lover, then you're gonna love this area because there's so many great options of dining. But the one thing I do recommend is make sure you make reservations in advance because these places are popular. We are here at Wahoo's Fish House and this spot is in Merle's Inlet. They catch their fish fresh every single day and have a very lively bar outside with music. Yes, live music, very cool. But I'm very excited to eat here. So let's just get to the main courses. We just got our food right now. Sarah got the seared salmon. There's some shrimp on top, but there's a nice creamy sauce here. Uh, I got the sea scallops. Let's try it. This this is also comes with some cheesy grits on the bottom. Mm. They taste great. They're really nice. They have this really subtle sweetness to them and kind of like ocean flavor. So these are great. I like that already. That's awesome. What'd you get? What was the sauce here or something? Salmon's great too. It's not like overpowering. Has a really nice sear to it. It's nice subtle fish. Good flavor and good seasoning. Awesome. We are here at Tidal Creek Brew House, and this spot is super family friendly. You actually can bring dogs here too, which is awesome. Open from morning to night, so you can come get your coffee. By the way, Louis is a level two Cicerone. That means like essentially it's a sommelier for beer. So he knows so what he's honored. talking about. It's much different than other breweries because they actually have a really good food offering. All this looks really beautiful and I love the way that these fries are cut because they're really nice and chunky, right? I got here a New England IPA that they have on tap, but they also told me that one of their flagship beers is a blonde style beer and also the Hefeweizen, uh, which is kind of like a German style beer. They also have oh, yeah. cocktails here, yeah. which is fabulous. I got their margarita. I got the powerhouse, mm. which is quinoa. You have chicken, you have vegetables. I'm trying my chicken salad wrap that I got here. So yeah. Thumbs up. Thumbs up. Very good. I don't think you can go wrong with anything you order here, for sure. Agreed. I am so excited because tonight we are going to see the Pirates Voyage Dinner Show. This show was established by Dolly Parton. It's kind of like medieval times meets Cirque du Soleil, but on a pirate ship, and it includes a four course meal. Uh, apparently there's mermaids and there's like an entire storyline. Let's get into it. This is so cool. It's an arena with a giant pool in the middle and there's two pirate ships. Bella is loving it. This is just so exciting. I can't wait to see the show start. What the? <gasps> Whoa! 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 There's more! All right, the show just finished. It was miraculous. They got seals, they got explosions, juggling, trampolines, people flipping, diving, singing, like everything you could possibly think of in two hours. It was incredible. Bella had an amazing time. My parents had an amazing time. Great for all ages. All I gotta say is this. Come here, come here, it's a great time. Thanks so much for joining me at Wander Surfside Beach. And remember, don't hesitate to use our concierge at any time during your stay to enhance your experience. And also, please tag Wander in any of your photos or videos so we can see how much fun you're having. We look forward to welcoming you, bye.